Hey, Sleazy. I was just getting my tweet out, and I'm gonna go uh, get a drink, and then we'll get started. Right? Ooh, let me fix that. I don't know why it does that. Also, let me make sure the captions are on. All right, captions are there, good. Well, hello, Sleazy. Give me a couple minutes to uh, clean off my desk and get a drink. I'll be back, enjoy the music.
Hello, sorry for the wait. Um, trying to get an old-fashioned maid took me more than I expected. I absolutely failed my dex check opening the whiskey. Oh, this is very low. Hey, small tie. How are you? Oh, man. How's everyone doing? Happy almost new year. If you're in Australia, it's already New Year. Uh, no, it was just, I just couldn't open. I was having the manual dexterity fail if it's a new bottle and it's slippery. Hey, Taru. No worries. I'm, uh, I'm here chilling for a few hours. And, uh... Oh, there's an eye staring at me. Cool, cool, cool. Camera, what are we doing? Camera, please. Hold, please. I don't know why the camera's doing this. Should it be on edge panning? Oh, follow flying creatures. I wonder if that's it. No. Okay, why? Why is the camera like this? Oh, is it? Good to know. I never had that superstition. I shouldn't say superstition. Um... I don't know why it looks sharper to me with no anti-aliasing. Okay. Oh no, you're you're right. I just didn't know specifically that on New Year's Day it was a thing you shouldn't do. Oh Jesus Christ, Historian. I thirst for combat. A wise move. <laughs> A guard's been killed. next got to concentrate got to press on um also i've absolutely this is a save where she um time to deal some punishment yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Oh my god. Hey, Black Chair. Well, shit. Oh, you whipped out a guardian of faith on me. Cool. Well, say goodbye. Are you for real? Oh, it's like that. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, I'm not wasting. I'm not wasting that. Cool, cool. Potion of speed. Fine. If that's what we want to do. Oh, nice. This is so much easier without what's her face there. Jesus Christ, Astarian. This is supposed to not be this hard of a fight. What the fuck? Here, heal your boyfriend. Let me strike. Well, not quite your boyfriend. I'm trying to get I'm trying to get women Thar and I keep fucking it up. Uh let me hit bless on everyone. Actually. And your Oh, do you not count for your own bless? Oh. Okay then. <gasps> oh, you hit me? That was such the wrong thing to do. You're gonna really attack provoke an attack of opportunity. Cool. Okay, but you're charmed. You should not be attacking me. I don't give a fuck about your friends. Bye. Aw, too bad. You're gonna have to die. What are you talking about, Black Widow? Oh, no, I have, no, what, it was more, I could pick three targets at level two, or I could pick four targets, but I couldn't target myself. That, that was my problem. 
of I'm casting it, so does that count for me by default? Ready for battle. Taking up position. Oh. No, it wasn't about the plus one. Yeah, um... I did the thing where... Oh, target must be an item. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Well, that's not enough. Well, fuck it. Arrow of the Damn, did that take you out? Aw. But you can't heal now. Stay focused. Yeah, um... I said jump. Jesus Christ. It's an action. Oh, so she basically gets a dark, misty step. Where the fuck did this eye come from? Oh, Gail. We're gonna need a long rest, god damn. You can't see me. Let's have some fun. Oh, hello. Let's play. But I see you. Unleash me. Damn, they're still standing. long rest before we actually go further in the tower. Jesus. Scrying eye. Escape. Yeah, definitely need a long rest once this is done. Yes. <sighs> I'm so sick of you.
Why do I need to be that fucking close? Cool, cool. Gail, why must you? Gail, I swear to God. Sorry, I'm not talking much. This is this is way more than I expected. Even with a souped up Gale, this is a hard fight. Fuck. On your command. Understood. How much are, ooh. Okay, not enough movement. Cool, cool, cool. This is a whole thing. Yeah, yeah. They got Minthara. You're undead? Cool. Yeah, this fight is hard, but I thought with a with a beefed up Gale it would be a little easier. I seriously thought with a beefed up Gale, this would be a lot easier. Jesus Christ, historian.
around. Let's go hurt someone. Okay, we're gonna have to go do a long rest because Jesus. Uh, so, oh wait. Oh my god, there's someone left. There's a scrying eye still left. Jesus. Yeah, we're gonna have to go. Thank you for those camp supplies. Siobhan is what? Take that cheese. Oh, that's moldy food. No, thank you. <laughs> so now that I'm not um, fighting for my life. How's everyone doing? I know Minthar is probably gonna yell, but I don't care. Because Mandara straight up, like, is not okay with you doing anything. Let's see, do any of you have anything to say? Just be quick. You wish to consult me? Well, I guess not. Sataru. Were you here when I ignored Gale's uh, let's get cozy scene? Basically when he takes you, tries to take you to the astral plane. That wasn't the... Y'all, can I have a moment? So, I tweeted asking for advice. Yes, I know, bad idea. So, so I said, that the camera I want that other friends use is no longer sold. Why does someone feel the need to tell me why the camera I clearly cannot get is a bad camera? And also they suggested a camera that I tried and had to return. You know what? I just... You know what, I'm not even gonna respond because they clearly did not read my fucking post. Literally, I said, I use a 6100 for when I'm on stream, but it's fixed in plates. Do they know what a 6100 costs? That's a big investment when crafting isn't my main content that I do. Hey, Broken Seals. 
Blackjack, you ain't never fucking lied. But it's like, I literally said in the tweet, in the tweet, I have a 6100. It's fixed in place. Also, a 6100 is too much money for me to, to spend when I don't do crafting streams all that often. I may do a crafting stream once a week. Maybe. Maybe. Also, it's not just the 6100, it's the dummy battery, it's all the other stuff. And I'm just here like, Jesus wept. You literally did not read what I wrote. Let's see, can I put this away? I can, okay. And I'm just like, hey DC. But I'm just like, you literally did not read what I wrote at all. Oh no, Broken Seals, what's wrong with your computer? Oh wait, I killed a merchant over here. What you got though? Oh, yes. Give me this armor. Oh, darn. Oh, wow. Oh, interesting. That sucks, I'm sorry. Oh yes, elixir of viciousness. Why is it showing me my equipped? God, I have so much stuff to sell, y'all. Oh, there's undead. The irony. So what if a Starian nicks himself? So question for the chat. If I use a, if I'm carrying, if I'm carrying an an undead, an arrow that damages undead. And I'm undead. Isn't there a chance? That that could kill me? Aw, gift from the absolute. Oh. 
Oh, this game just straight up said no. Wow, it really won't let me, uh... There we go. I am missing my like legit backpack though. Oh, that's wine. Why am I... So this is just me rambling before we go into combat. Because now it's the thought I won't leave alone. Of if I'm undead and I'm carrying an arrow that hurts the undead and I cut myself on it. Isn't it possible Oh, you need to send that to camp because we need heavy armor right now Good lord, man Sorry, I am my so much shit when this fight is done. Oh, can't get that anymore. Oh, this is narrow. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Oh, I know it's just more of a there's so much shit that should work that doesn't and vice versa oh I did not realize panda was on interesting Huh. Sorry, no, I'm I'm getting distracted before I go do this long ass fight. Oh my god, why? Indeed. Oh, these motherfuckers.
Will I? Will I though? Why? Okay, I long rested. What the fuck? Did we not actually rest? Christ on a cracker, Astarian. My victims are Hey, Selena. I will not fail. Fun. Trying to get Catholic Thorm taken care of. You motherfucker. Our flank, our smart. You motherfucker. have to wonder about these folks. That's where you are. Cool, cool, cool. With the mess. Can't give up. Not now. Onward. You know what? Jesus age. Fresh orders. A bold maneuver. Oh, no, you don't. Force. I wonder. Ooh, Mercolite Scourge. I can't use that Shadow Heart Cam, though. Thank you. Yep, here we go. About this. So this is going to be interesting. We don't have... You. You. What have you done? 
What have you done to me? Nothing more than you deserved. Impossible. You are a thrall. A slave. Am I? Am I? You serve the absolute. You serve me. Bow, you dog. Bow! Mm, no. I don't think so. Okay, that should have broken my back. The prison. You've had it all this time, you worm. Yup. You will bow before me. And if you will not bow, you will break. It's, it's the um, armor that you can make in the Grimforge with Vanta Black nice dye. To... Oh, hey, Catherick. Checkmate. <gasps> Jesus. The game really said, we got you, bro. Ugh. Oh no, you're not. Why did you run over there? Time to kill. Let's move. How are you? Happy almost new year to you. Conjuration, not concentration. I'm going to actually. Your command. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Oh, Catherine came down to fight. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, no. Well. They're focused on Gale. I guess I have to kill you now. Jesus. I'm gonna use all my luck points at this at this rate. Even with souped up armor. Hey Catherick. My lord, Beck! 
beckons me. You have no idea what you're meddling with. You're a pawn, a slave to forces you cannot comprehend. Yeah, yeah. Everyone always says that. I am the chosen, and you. Tentacle was colossal. How can such a thing be possible? Unleash me.
was killed. My faith will protect me. Heading there. Catherick leads. We've no choice but to follow. Crooked touch. What's in here? I'll just help myself. May the darkness protect you. Fine. What's on your mind? How are you holding up? Don't be so modest. I can't remember the last time I met someone like you. Perhaps I never did. And never will again. Greetings.
Mark my words. This power would be no blessing, but a curse. You might as well ask me to gouge out my eyes for the promise of sight, or slice off my tongue for the promise of taste. The mere suggestion is an insult. Gladly. Seems not. All right. You wish to consult me? Always a delight to speak with you. What can I do? Windows? Okay, do you hear me now? You mean I've been talking for over an hour and no one's heard me? Fuck! I've been talking to people. I've asked you a question, Melissa. I've been talking this whole time. Windows apparently decided to mute my mic. Windows, not me, not OBS then that's Windows. I didn't, and I haven't touched it. Windows just decided to mute my mic. What in the entire fuck? <sighs> yeah, I didn't do that. Windows did that on its own. Uh, I was just going to ask if the schedule's actually posted yet, because I got that email yesterday. Nope, I was not. Windows decided to uh, mute the mic for me. I was playing, so I didn't even touch the microphone. So I don't know why Windows decided that was a thing it wanted to do.
Yeah, and I was playing the game, so there's no way I tabbed out and accidentally hit it. So, yeah. back at you, impossibly wide. A single tentacle burrowed through stone. Oh, that was not what I wanted. Thanks, Broken Seals, for your resub. I never managed to get the, the group screenshot of them right before they jump in. Oh, this, this is gross. This is an illithid colony. Oh. This must be where they harvest the tadpoles. We're close to the source of the infections. Ah, here we are. The infection at the heart of Moonwalks. That annoys me because I was talking to you all. Tread carefully. We are very close to the source I, of the absolute now. I didn't touch that those. I, I can see. A tempest. I can see exactly where the mute is on my keyboard. I did not touch it. I was playing the game and using WASD. Or clicking attacks. I don't know how that happened. I didn't accidentally mute from the keyboard. Because I would have to do con control of function and another button. So no, that's not what I did. Oh, no, I can answer because this is going to take Descend, me a while. Because I wanted to post my my con schedule, so I just didn't know if I needed to. Oh, email's not come in yet. Oh, Fresh recruits for Catherick's army. I can smell such rot. To a necromancer, a morgue is a muster yard. I am so beyond annoyed, y'all. <gasps> is us. Us is here, but we must have damaged us. Oh no. No! No touch! It is wrong. Other. Sing other song together then, but away from here. Still loves me. We are free! Thank you, friend. But perils remain near and far. Better to stay together. You and us, we... We will remain with you. Call us. And we will be at your side. But think always chop, chop, chop.
I didn't even get in the door. What in the absolute like fuck? Oh, that's a greater zombie. That's going to do fuck all. Immune to frighten. Great. Death Shepherd. Moving. Fuck. Let me strike. Onward. Yeah, I gotta remember to get Tess to take with me. Oh, I'm not actually that worried about Aresia since you still require masks. Only had it once, that was enough. Oh my god, why? Can had a winged horror. You son of a biscuit. <laughs> mm. 
Well, shit. Y'all for real? Oh my god, are you for real? Oh, I hate to rest while our enemies still draw breath. Minthara. Whatever experiments Balthazar performed here. I fear he made more than thralls and ghouls. Oh, he absolutely did. Oh, this is gonna be... Oh, I'm not doing that puzzle. I hate that puzzle. I hate that puzzle. Certainly. As far as I know, I've only had it the one time. Because I've gotten to a point I don't entirely trust home tests anymore. Discern. We depart. Mm. Okay. I'm gonna leave you all for a hot second in this lovely abode while I get a Descend, very quick bio, ba bio break. Uh, talk amongst yourselves, what are you doing for New Year's? I'll be back in a couple minutes. Yes. 
descend. Obey. Assemble. Prepare. Evacuate. Prepare. Descend. Obey. Assemble. Assemble. Descend, assemble. Evacuate.
descend. Hello. Obey. For a second, I thought I heard my own voice, and I was going to be horrified. Hey, Galen, thanks for your resub. How are you? Hey, Van, how are you? Oop, wrong way. That is where I just came from. Very well, then. Descend, assemble. Oh. Nope, not ready to go there yet. Oh, nice. Nope, too soon. And I've already been there. No. Evacuate. No charcuterie, not charcuterie. Wow, no descend. I would like charcuterie. What's on the charcuterie board? I'm nosy. So y'all- players and civilians, side by side. Y'all know- This must be where they infect and transform those they kidnap. How many different times I've been in here and until recently did not realize that there was an actual I can let everyone out button. Didn't know that, but I don't know who's gonna be in here because this is a save where I killed the tieflings and the grove. I'm pretty sure Will's dad is a non-issue. And oh my God, I made that strong. Well, it's strong. I ordered one of those pre-made Cocktails in a bottle and Jesus the forms a telepathic connection with the device and a chorus of static energy fills your mind Every mind flare in the room calls Ooh, that sounds good from its pod seeking release Can we do that one night at the con Melissa? But there are others in the pods those not yet infected not yet a lithid terrified desperate to escape Oh, that's that was my other question. Can you send me my hotel info? I have no idea what it is. I just know where I'm staying. Just not any other info. Because I want to add it to my Marriott account. Oh, no. Well, shit. Not the room number, just the reservation number so I can add it to my Marriott account. Just so I can get credit for the, uh... So I can get credit for that on my account. Oh, wow, this is strong. This is so strong. And if it's a big deal, no worries. I just wondered. Woof.
And as many times I've been in Boston, you'll laugh at me. I do not know the place that well. Ah, uh, you miss me. On your command. Uh, that fucking mind flare moved. Where did you come from? No! <gasps> Holy shit! Let me know, because Eugenio and I are also trying to figure out um, getting some time in, because we have not... Uh... We did not get any time in during PAX Unplug. Oh, and I need to add, um, I had a thought and it absolutely left me. <gasps> no! Well, you have revivified, don't you? You don't. But you do have a scroll. Take you. This is not how I die. Yeah, we just haven't had a chance to chat because he just got back, so... So it's more of a... I should call him. Yeah, so...
Well, it's dead now. Your command. Christ in a, on a cracker. Patched up. Pushing on. I can feel it. I don't know how to thank you. I thought I was done for. This is a bleeding shit show. Well, remember, I Hold don't have time dead. because I've got the, the thing with pirate right after. Tentacles. We came here to rescue Duke Ravenguard. But we didn't stand a chance. Uh, and I answered your other question. Yeah. He was in one of the pods. The cultists took him away. He was still human and still trying to put up a fight. Well, we know he's not there because we saw him with Gortash. Yeah, so he went to visit folks. And, uh... I don't know, I feel... I don't want to bother people too much. Oh, that's right. I had them flipped. I had them flipped, never mind. For some reason I thought the signing was first and then the... A quick rummage. Baldur's Gate will no, I design. Oh, stench. I'm beginning to think I should have stayed in that pod. In there, it only smelled like me. Is there any news about Duke Ravenguard? Did he get out alive? No. Tell by your expression. <laughs> Gonna have to fall on my sword, aren't I? Wait, isn't the masquerade on Sunday? Right. Mm. I freely admit, I kind of fell off on Paul and Storm ages ago. Blind pools, but empty of tadpoles. Unusual. Harvesting all the larvae indicates they are getting ready for something big. You know what I just realized? No Mizora because Will left the party. Oh, I know. I just, I, I only knew who he was because I used to follow Paul and Storm. But I know he's not performing. I have no, so I feel bad because I have no idea who the musical guests are. Like some who worked here were not thralls or undead. They were loyal to Catherick and his grim cause. Ah, my favorite place. Gotcha. Oh my god, I forgot about... General Thorm was attacked. The order to evacuate given. You should not be here. I conclude you are one of the attackers. 
Oh, I love how it's Minthara and not Astarian in this moment. Trying to pull rank. And yet not a word of concern for our dear Jen. I shall present your bones to General Thorm as retribution for what you did to him. Lady, you need to go outside. we're doing cool 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 on my way Away. I might have to go long rest for real. This is not going the way that I thought it would. I mean, I was just gonna text you when I took a break to ask when you are streaming today. Uh, can I get a shout out for Lamia? Okay, I will not be on still by then. My victims await. Ah, uh, no, that is mod only. Lama, you can give yourself a shout out. <laughs> oh my god, just hit this dude. Is the advantage. Damn, we are really gonna need... Not sure why that didn't work. There. It should have. Okay, there's nothing in here. Nope, don't want a leg. I'm good. I'm good. Don't mind if I do. It's exclamation SO for the bot shout out. That's weird. Uh, but yes, also, please feel free to give me a to-do to add you to the bot so that it goes in the go-live channel. The 
city calls out for salvation. The Chosen are my heart. There are so many that would need a Norseloid fleet. My word. I'm okay. I, uh... Descend. Prepare. I'm trying to do everything in here before I go descend. I feel like I missed something. Yeah, I know I can't fast travel. Call of the Blood, take the long road home. Oh, that is... Oh, damn. So you can't lift the Shadow Curse without Halson. All right, so I need to see what's down here. Oh, nope, that is to go talk to the Elder Brain. I'm not ready for that yet. Because once we get down there, I get to fight Catherick. And I don't want that yet. Descend, assemble. Obey. Evacuate. Also, this area is just disgusting. Has that area always been there? Oh no, that is where we killed all the zombies. How did you long rest? It's not, um, it's not letting me do camp here. I want to know why they have money. Like, what could you possibly need money for? At all. Prepare the march. My chosen. Happy New Year's Eve. Nope, no thank you. Shah's blessing upon you. <laughs> uh, that's a little too too much blood. Even for me. Wow, there's too much blood for a Starian. Thank you for your resub. You know that this is too much fucking... When even a Starian, the vampire, is like, no thank you. Descend. Mm, I'd rather not. Obey. Evacuate. Right? Oh, there is no getting out. Well, well, shit. Well, the fact that he's like, this is too much blood for me. I 
Like, wow. How fucked up must it be in here? Well, I guess we've done everything. Well, I guess we're going to talk to the Elder Brain. Like, aren't you going to leave? Y'all just hanging out? And the fact that he's like, nah, this is too much blood, I'm out. Oh, you can't go past the brine. Huh. Well then. The moment comes. Must it? We have so much shit to sell once we get out of here, y'all. I guess it's time to go talk to the Elder Brain. The squeaky noise bothers me so much. Lamy, are you enjoying streaming so far? Oh, wow, that is so strong. No longer a background murmur, the presence in your mind builds to a roar. We found it. The absolute is behind this door. Good. Here we go. We know who you are. Ah, uh, the three. I really hate this part so fucking much. You said it was under control. It isn't you I answer to, Gortash. Oh. Oh, the general voice. Is this where we salute? Salute, yes. With cleavers through his blood-starved flesh. How it crawls with failure. Like flies on lick-wet carrion. You forget yourself, Orin. I have played my part. You have built an army for our masters, true enough. But what of the astral prison? A rogue, true soul, flaunting it under your nose all this time. And you ran from him. Sure that they would follow and deliver it into my hands here. If you would cease these distractions. The distractions have been yours, Ketherick. Oh, perhaps we never should have dug your daughter up. Oh? <sighs> so you haven't lost your edge. But you're still not as sharp as Orin, I wager. His crypt breath sings to my sinews again, 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 again. But he must lead the murder march to Baldur's grave. If the weapon is truly in your grasp, Ketherick, might I suggest closing your fist? Orin and I can wait for you no longer. 
The plan proceeds. Also, we're going to the Gortash, city, please and we go take a bath. You to follow, army and the weapon in tow. The Edict of Bane. The Lash of Bane. I got Catherick is like, must I do this Captain Planet bullshit? Oh, nice. By one elder brain. The Testament of Merkel. An elder brain. Hamer. One of the cruelest and most powerful creatures in existence. Enslaved by mere mortals. Look at that crown. It radiates with power unlike anything I've ever what? seen. To have it. To hold. Oh, if only I could. But I can't. Oh, really? This is it. I must do as Mistra commands. What choice do I have? More than just a goddess counts of my courage. Whole worlds Has anyone done that? The balance. So has anyone done the let Gale blow you up thing? Because I don't think I've ever done it. So I'm going to let this sink and I'm going to go get a snack and I'll be right back. Oh, it ends the game. I just didn't know if any of you, <laughs> any of you had ever done it. Because I know I have not done that. Yay. All right. Sorry for the ASMR. Are you dead? What happened? Was the game over? All right. Let's see what happens and I'm gonna reload. <coughs> Excuse me. So I've never actually done it. One last gust of weave. One last gale to end them all. 
Oh my god, not with a pun. No. Like, everyone else is like, I didn't agree to this shit. The smoking ashes of Moonrise Towers, the Elder Brain lies destroyed. But what of the tadpoles it commanded? Freed of the Absolute's control, they will complete their transformations. A plague of illithids will soon descend on the Sword Coast, enslaving all they do not infect. It is an ending of swords. Though not the one destiny had in store for you. Wait, what? I'm sorry, what? Wow, if you decide to use the, the orb. I thought it was about to like put us back like, JK, just kidding. No, um, I think I may have gotten it before. Yeah, I, um, I decided to see what happens if you choose, uh, the orb. It's just, it's game over, man. It's game over. And, uh, you unleash all the illithids. So good job, Gail. What choice do I have? More than just a goddess counts with my courage. Whole worlds hang in the balance. I... I have no desire to end your life, you know that. To end it? To struggle on? It is a grave choice you're making right? for us both. But if it must be so... Very well. I'll stand down to stand also, by you. This, um, this taco. There we are. It wouldn't do. Salad I got was not great. Guest. Behold, Duke Graven Guard, the absolute. Whom preserve us? You wag your word, flap in vain, old Elaine. Once the worm holds the whip, your shredded flesh will serve us. Now, it's really time we were going. We will empty this place and begin the march. You may catch up with the army once you've retrieved the weapon. And Ketherick, do try it. Sulk. You're supposed to be the fearsome general come to conquer the city. And I am the hero who will save it. So it is time, faithful ones. March. 
Well, shit. Okay, I'm gonna be right back. I know I just left, but this taco dip is not is not the move. It's kind of disgusting. Hey, Picaro. So that was gross. I miss going. I um I did the Gale use the orb solution. It was a very permanent end. Oh shit, she has like no potions. I'm sure she has no potions. Ready and willing. Uh, it ends the game. Game showed up like, cool, cool. I guess that's all you're doing. Yeah, it's like game over, man. Game over. Yeah, and then uh, everyone else becomes mind flayers. Oh, I could use that. Oh, absolutely. Yes, please. Um, arcane cultivation. Oh, necrotic resistance would be great. A 
awaiting orders. Actually, you make that. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can change her spells. Blessing. Magic weapon is the most useless shit ever. Welcome back, Lamia. No rest for the wicked, I see. What now? Yeah, lot, Lamia. Mistress Hole. Let me just make sure you die. Did not seem thought through. I'm ready. <sighs> yes. Ma'am, I need you. Terminator's axe. Ooh. Well, fuck that. You wearing that then? <clears throat> Cause as we've seen, this is not going to be an easy fucking fight. Oh, interesting. Even with the black and azure dye, that red stays. Huh. Oh, blessing, she has the box of rings. Does not have what I need though. Fuck. Nah. Okay, she's got AC nineteen armor on. That's gonna help quite a bit. My faith will guide me. You sure about that? Also... So I'm trying to make sure everyone has their shit together before we go into combat. Yeah, I really want to change her outfit, her colors. Where's the drow black tie? Okay, there we go. Mm. 
Salutations. Watch your back. I feel like he had an extra cape. I guess not. Predicted. What is it, I wonder, that draws one toward death like a moth to light? You could have run away, absconded with the prism. The one thing that could prevent me from fulfilling my destiny. But the lure of one's destiny is irresistible, isn't it? Perhaps you hope to learn your place in history before you are erased from it. A bright flash of clarity before the snuffing out. No, what? Sorry. So earlier, I talked about how people didn't read what the fuck I wrote. Someone suggested a mirror. You know what, I'm just going to stop answering this and I'm going to delete my post because people did not read what I wrote. So on Twitter and Blue Sky, I asked for recommendations for a camera for crafting streams because Parkara and I actually were talking about that yesterday when we played games. The Brio is not great, apparently. You know, I can't zoom in, I can't get the color I want, etc. And I put a tweet out saying specifically, the M200 is discontinued. It's the camera that Pirate, Zero, and Panda uses for crafting. It's discontinued. Also, crafting isn't my primary stream content, so I didn't want to spend a lot of money. I've been recommended literally the camera I use, my DSLR, the A6100. Someone recommended a mirror. Someone recommended a Razer product, which 
One, I don't use Razer products. Two, I can't because of my Logitech sponsorship. And other people are suggesting, because me saying I don't want to spend a lot of money, they're suggesting, well, just get a used M200. Well, if the camera's discontinued, why would I get it? Someone literally said a, a mirror for a one-off when I said, this isn't a one-off. No, nothing in that tweet said it's a one-off. So I'm like, okay. Wow, this is a rude ass reply. Hey, Professor Ashley, welcome on in. Welcome, welcome. What were y'all doing? place is to die so that I might finally live. Let us speak plainly. My Lord Merkel gave me the one thing I desired, the one thing no other god could grant me. My daughter's life returned. Her heart beating once more. Well, about that. For that, he asked that I serve as his chosen. Join Orin and Gortash to grow the cult of the Absolute, and then take control of it. He's never had a more devoted follower. I have fought great wars before, in the service of other gods and other powers. But for Merkel, I would condemn all of Faerun to death. You are all that stands between me and my destiny. And you have brought the prism here. I will kill you now. And then I will raise you as my servant. He's so matter of fact about this. Hey, face on. Oh, someone on Blue Sky was like, well, I don't stream, but. And I was like. Cool. When I, my post specifically says people who stream this content. And I'm just like, you know what? This is why I drank. But welcome, Raiders. What were you up to? What were you doing? Yes. Join the army of the dead, true soul. Witness Lord Merkel's glory. Oh, how is Killer Frequency? I don't think I've ever played that. Well, that ended that. What a fool you are. You cannot kill me. I am eternal. Oh, no. Merkel, Lord of Bones, I am here. I am ready. I am what yours. What's the problem, Bakaro?
Well, shit. By Mistress Silken Tresses. What the fuck kind of... Sorry. Oh, blessings. Does anyone else have a potion of speed? Nope. Good job, me. I'm like, Gail, what death's cold grip. What do you mean by that, Gail? <clears throat> oh, that's not going to work. <coughs> well, shit. Sorry. I thirst for combat. Do you? Do you though? Are you fucking for real? Second. Mm. Oh, us, you're so sweet. Devour intellects. Oh shit. Why would I want Merkel to look at me?
Are you abs? No, don't do it. No, get out of my brain! Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Impossible. Death cannot take me. I am its master. My lord, hear me. Nothing. I am forsaken. You. You have no idea what you've done. Uh, Isabel. Hey, drive. Catherick's nether stone. It's in his armor. Take it. Oh, my God, shut up. I'm a little bit more worried about my companions. What the fuck? Let's get you on your feet. Jesus. A quick rummage. In death, the body is cooling. Energy radiates from the stone. Remarkable. Truly. Now the picture comes together. The Absolute is neither God nor man. It is the Elder Brain you saw, held here by those three against its will. The crown it wears controls it. And these stones control the crown. Oh shit, Dre. I hope it has been dominated. Okay. To master an elder brain. To subdue it. Our enemies are formidable. I believe you fought and defeated an avatar of Merkel, the god of necromancy. A remarkable feat. 
Ketherick was Merkel's chosen. I know Lord Enver Gortash, an arms dealer and a slaver. He is a worshipper of Bane, the god of tyranny. The other is a mystery to me, but the way she spoke, it's most likely she follows Baal, the god of murder. Which means the Absolute is a front for the gods of death. And our enemies are chosen of the dead three. Bane, Baal, and Merkel. The Tyrant, the Assassin, and the Necromancer. They are known to pick from their most devout followers a Chosen, granting them incredible powers. Each one alone would be a formidable enemy, but working together, and with those stones and that crown, I cannot imagine what they might achieve. Perhaps not a cure, but you've found the source of your infection. And the reason for its abnormality. The crown atop the Elder Brain. Its markings suggest it was forged in Netheril. An ancient empire whose mastery over magic rivaled that of the gods. The crown's Netherese magic must be the true source of the parasite's abilities. This must be what elevates their potential. And it must be the reason nobody could heal you. If the crown can do this to the parasites, I dare not imagine what it is doing to the brain. Netherese? These Chosen are powerful indeed to have such magic in their command. I know. But this is the only way. This is the battle of our lives. And the lives of everyone the in Faerun. The army of the Absolute is marching on Baldur's Gate. Within the city, an elder brain brimming with power, ready to turn everyone within its reach into mind flayers. All it needs is an order. An order the Death God's Chosen are on the cusp of giving. We must wrest control of the brain from the Chosen before that happens. We must take their stones. Our chances of success are slim, but we must not fail. If we fail, Everything ends. I will be your shield, but you must be the sword. And when the chance to strike comes, Welcome, you must Raiders. take it. What were you up to, Adina? Be one chance. Time to go. It's been With a long Zelda. Day. Better stop to rest soon. Oh, Gail. We should not link. I can't help but feel like I've been fumbling in the dark for too long. And I've just had a lit torch thrust into my hands. Indeed. Under other circumstances, I might have been subdued or ashamed. But after what we saw, I must admit, I'm excited. The crown! The one the Elder Brain was wearing. The one that oh, really destroyed. Netherese magic. So pure, so complete, that I didn't even recognize it at first. Most Netherese artifacts contain only the faintest amount of their former power. The ghost of an echo of a memory. That crown was different. I can't fathom how such a wonder survived. <laughs> Surely everything of its ilk was destroyed along with Netheril itself, but no matter. It exists. I must learn more of it. I know what nearly happened, and I'm sorry for putting you in that position, but I've stepped back from the precipice now. I've seen what may prove to be another way. 
a better way. That crown sits on a gargantuan elder brain bent on destroying us and everything we hold dear. Enjoy dinner. Understanding its true nature might unlock the means of our victory. We need to learn more about what we saw. An artifact as powerful as that crown must have been documented somewhere. Well, about that, Gail. As luck would have it, we'll soon find ourselves near one of the finest book collections this side of Candlekeep. Sorceress Sundries. I need to go there and learn all I can. Book shopping? But yes. Hey, Fraser. Their collection of rare How toys are you? is un. Well, come on in. <laughs> Nethery sex are hardly commonplace, but how goes? I'm I'll have one or two. Uh, can I get a shout out for Fraser's You'll George? have to forgive my eagerness, but if my suspicions prove to hold water, this could be the answer to all our problems. A little small talk. We should not linger. I will never tire of sitting on dead men's thrones. My blood ran hot when we broke Ketherick's bones together. But we have greater challenges ahead of us. Do it we? is clear now that he was not working alone. During my time in the cult, I came to know one of his co-conspirators all too well. Baal's blood letter. Orin. To think, I thought her to be speaking for the absolute. I worshipped that woman. Jealous? You needn't be. When Orin is in my hands, her agony will nourish me. She is the Iblis who indoctrinated me with the Absolute's lies. Only that he serves Bane, which could make him a petty lordling or a despot capable of bending the world to his will. That he has enslaved Illithids to fulfill his ambitions strongly suggests he is the latter. She is fierce, vicious, and cruel. In those respects, <laughs> we are alike. But she is dangerously unpredictable. If there is a way to turn this design towards hey, Salter, God. How are rather you? than Happy control, New Year. she will take it. She is the one who brought me to Moonrise, and into the presence of her so-called God. Absolute. Now I know that those memories are lies. There was no God. Orin held me down in a cocoon of flesh, while a mind flayer forced a parasite into my brain. And she loved okay, just at my fear. And Thar's story is so sad. I will murder her. her. And I will smile. It is as if you read my mind. Perhaps you did. In killing Catherick, we fractured the cult's leadership. When we break the other Chosen and claim their Netherstones, we can take control. In the long history of these realms, Few people have attempted anything so bold. What I propose is nigh on impossible, but if anyone can succeed, it is us. We have the prism, and True. we have the courage to slay Counts gods. Us. We may fail, but we must try. 
the power of the enslaved Elder Brain could reshape the world. We could reshape the world. And then we will need no gods. We will be their equal. We will be absolute. We have a purpose and a bond. By my oath, I will fight with you while that purpose holds. There is yet one thing about you that troubles me, though. Something I need you to explain. When we killed the tieflings at the Grove, I was not in control of my actions. Oh... You do not have that excuse. So I ask you, why? Why kill oh, them? Oh, this question. This question. Minthara is not fucking around. I love this writing, but oh god. <laughs> I'm flattered. Will you be bringing dead rats and birds to my tent <laughs> now that we share a camp? Hey, Rex. I jest, but it is as good a reason as any. I have done much more foolish things to win the respect of far inferior people. people. I am satisfied. Now, I am ready to leave this damned place whenever you give the word. The city awaits. Um, everyone's on a power trip. This is my darkest timeline run. There are important matters to discuss. We have uh, murdered everyone in the grove. Will and Karlak left because they're not evil. Um, Lazelle's left to camp, and Minthara is always with me. The shadows yet fester. The dead three united under cover of darkness. The balance shifts. There are depths to this alliance yet unplumbed. Consider, mortal. Do illithids possess souls? No. Nor canst thou count mind flares among them. Yet, the three amass an illithid army void of apostolic souls that could Shut. imbue them with power. A flock without souls, yet to what end, mortal? This is the question thou must come to answer. Until such time, be availed of my services. Weren't you already in camp? Where matters of balance are concerned, I am eternally called. No. Damn, Withers. Yes, Bane, Lord of Darkness, Baal, Lord of Murder, Merkel, Lord of Bones. Once judged, Ascended, then vanquished as one and as three. The alliance is reforged, mortal. The plains thus quake, and the gods shudder. On my way. Well, it leads outside. I want to check downstairs before I leave. Because I feel like we don't get to take Mintharis stuff. 
when you break her out of prison. Oh shit. I just left them smoking. So do you just lose all of Minthara's gear then? Um, and cats a lot. Let me know if at any point you want to swap. The diamond for a mod sword. All right, I guess. I guess you just don't get Minthara's equipment, huh? That's why I came down here, because I'm like... What happens to her equipment when they put her in jail? Oh, there's no doors here. Interesting. Oh. Oh, that's sad. Oh, Shaz is on late. I wonder if they are staying on till midnight. I like how it's still stealing. Even though there's no one in here. Oh, okay. So for those of us who are not, or who are still in Oh, it's just the other door. Okay. Hey, man. Right? Game's like... We gonna make you work for this shit. See, I'm getting all these good-ass rolls on just unlocking a chest. But no, when I need an important role, the game's like, lol, no.
it's mine now. Evidence. <laughs> e dirty twenty. Oh, brow beaten circlet, nice. That's actually useful. I guess that was it. Okay then. So I want to explore because you can't come back to Moonrise once you leave, right? Oh, this is the bad place. This is the really bad place. <coughs> what in the absolute fuck? Mm. Well, I think I've done everything I can. Uh, this is the evil run, so we aren't able to stop the Shadow Curse. And I'm pretty sure... There's no option for me to do anything useful. Uh. Yeah, it looks like this is the end of Act 2 for our group. Oh, all of the... I wish I'd known that was there. I would have tried to do that on my run where I saved them. Because I do have a run where I save the two flings. Huh. I wonder if there's a dirt mound in every cell. Which would be weird, but okay. Because of my decisions in this game. True. Hey, Brian. Happy almost new year. Yeah, so uh, this is the evil run, just so people know. I'm pretty sure that tree just moved. Uh, Brian, there should be a thing headed your way as well from your throne list. From me. Ooh, food. You're welcome. 
I'm surprised Throne didn't tell you you had something. Throne narks on everybody if I get a gift. Even if it doesn't tell me what it is, just that someone has bought something off your list. I was... I was... I was slacking in every way on gifts this year. That was fine. I know DC has done me a kindness and it's uh, en route. Whatever DC has done. I mean, Throne sends so many emails. <gasps> a cat! Wait, we don't have animal speaking prepared. <laughs> ah, Steel Claw. Quiet, lest I miss its cries for mercy. Oh, pardon me, ma'am. Quiet, lest I miss its cries for mercy. All right, well, I wasted animal speaking for that, thanks. Thanks, game. Shar's blessings upon you. Oh good, we can take all of that weird drow stuff. Yes, it didn't want to talk to me much, though. I think it talks to you more before the fight happens. <laughs> Although I discovered in another playthrough that you run into her again, possibly. Oh, did you take their tadpole away? Oh no. <laughs> well, all right then, I guess we're leaving. Let's make sure that we've taken everything we can. Ah. Well, Withers won't tell me shit, so I guess it's time to go. <sighs> to Boulder's Gate. the heart of the absolute alive get out of my fucking head Thanks to you you did well to defeat ketherick yeah but you Ketheric weren't any was fucking only the help first to fall there are many more battles ahead and they will not be so easily won you will need allies you have the makings of a leader your actions have already inspired those around you Mwah. But if we are to succeed, we will need others. Are we supposed to do that today? Good. I am glad to hear that. Shoulders Gate may not know it yet, but its fate is bound to ours. Seek on its streets those whose purpose aligns with our own, and invite them to our cause. Ah, gotcha. Together, we will put an end to the Absolute, the Chosen, all. Oh, nice. I see you tagged us. I will retweet it.
Oh, this, that fucker wouldn't let me leave. Like, are you just gonna not let me have a moment of peace? Still taints the land. Perhaps we could have lifted it had we tried. We tried, Shadowheart. We were missing a very important part of that, namely Halson. It looks like a horde stomped past here. I don't have any loose ends. I've. This is the save where I've only got five Rick people. Defeated. The path ahead clear. You should be elated. The sight of the land you leave behind does nothing to alleviate your sorrow. Oh shit, that's right. We failed. We failed hard. Because we killed the Night Song. So I wonder now what happens to Laroican when you tell him you've killed the Night Song. Oh, shit. Ah! Well, that was a weird load screen. Oh, Gortash. If you're paying attention, something isn't right about the way she walks in general. Sergeant, if you are here, I presume Wern's Rock is secure. And preparations for my inauguration are complete. No, Lord Gortash. We were interrupted. Another quake in the lower city. More severe this time. So you came cowering to my chambers? I'm flattered, Sergeant. But even I cannot command natural phenomena to cease. Forgive me, sure? my lord. But there is panic in the streets. The oh, people I hope are afraid. Does. Perhaps the people would be calm if you kept your nerve. I expect better from the flaming fist than to run scared from a slight tremor in the earth. Get back to your duties. Duties, duties, duties. 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 Patrolling and saluting and following and bowing and scraping. Yes, sir. No, sir. Rip and cut your throat, sir. Your plan is falling apart, Lordling. Give me a reason not to cut you to ribbons. Control yourself, Orin. We need to focus on reuniting the stones or the brain will break free. These quakes are just the start. Neither of us expected the prison bearers to kill Catherick. They'll be traveling to the city. Let's make sure we give them a Baldurian welcome. I itch to be with you. To split your skin. To see your skull shine in the light. Little tyrant. <sighs> Lucky for you, I harvested a whole family of living flesh in Rivington at High Sun. They will sate my blade thirst tonight. Oh. But tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow, my blades will thirst again. Somebody earlier was saying that uh, Maggie was apparently told to tone it down. Beyond the campsite, the city waits in uneasy silence, one sleep away. I love this so much.
Alright, so why am I standing over Minthara like this, though? Also, that was such a Dragon Age end of game screenshot. When I saw this the first time, I was like, is the game over? Did we break something? Okay, I don't think I need... You wish to consult me? I take no pleasure in his past. Right? Whatever faults he may have had, Catherick was a great leader. Of course. He ruled Moonrise for centuries. I wonder if I fucked that up. That in itself deserves respect. I believe he was an honorable man, but the gods used him as their plaything. First, Shah and her sister. Then the three behind the Absolute. I sympathize. As are we. And if the coming battle breaks us, I hope that someone will mourn our passing, despite the bodies we have left in our wake. A true soul came to my city, preaching a message of togetherness. Accompanied by two novices. Menzoberanzen is not fertile ground for such messages. I killed them and hey, hanged their bodies in my garden. Damn. I would have picked prettier corpses if my intentions had been aesthetic. This was a warning against heresy. I was not content with the warning, though. I intended to wage war on their insolent god and the rest of its followers. Even as the flesh sagged and sloughed away from their eyeless skulls, their audacity infuriated me. I had to know where they came from. And whoever sent them was counting on my curiosity overcoming my caution. Indeed. A man you know all too well. General Catherick Thorm. <laughs> the dead cough up their secrets just as well as the living. All it took was a simple act of necromancy, and the corpses told me where I needed to strike. Moonrise Towers. No. I was prepared for combat. But I intended to strike subtly, as it turned out to my shame. I was defeated without even drawing my weapon. I came to Moonrise with a retinue of warriors and assassins, the best House Bane Ray had to offer. I expected a battle, but found a fully laden feast table and a welcome befitting a house matron. <sighs> Catherick expected us, expected me, and I fell for his flattery. Perhaps I deserved what came after the welcome I don't as well. Think so. Catherick proposed an alliance between Moonrise and Menzo Baranzen. I admit I, I was captivated by him. He invited me to the head of his table. As his guest of honor. I was wary, of course. If I had been in his position, the food would have been poisoned. It was not the food I should have been wary of. It was the pale woman at the foot of the table. Orin the Red. We had barely begun to eat when she spoke for the first time. I only caught one word. My name. Then, quick as lightning... She climbed onto the table, a dagger in each hand, and skipped toward me, slicing the throats out of my men as she passed them. Few things frighten me. Orin is one of them. Catherick held me still, 
his hand on my shoulder, the grip tight enough to crack the bone. When Orin stood before me, she touched the dagger to my eye, drawing out a tear of blood. Right? I want this one, she said. Ketherick nodded his permission, and I was taken below. You've seen the horrors of the colony. Orin kept me there for days. She forced me to watch as my men were processed. Some for food, others as thralls. And then she placed the tadpole in my eye herself. I deserved it. I was passive, weak, proud. You know the rest as well as I do. There were massacres before the grove. Religious communities, mostly. Those who refused to convert. Then there was you, and now there is freedom. <laughs> Soon there will be vengeance. Well. Over there. Hello, lover. Oh. Always a delight to speak with you. What can I do? So I ignored Gail's romance scene where he like invite basically offers you the weave or real or the real thing. So now I wonder A, can I still romance Minthara? So I feel like there should be a mm. Shah's blessings upon you. I have ignored Lazelle pretty much. I'm listening. Wow, you don't sound so fucking excited to talk to me. And now we get to fight those monks. The events of the last days weigh heavily upon you. Sleep's rest is slow to come to one whose mind is so full. The Absolute is not a god, but an elder brain controlled by the Chosen of the Dead Three. They mean to use it to take control of the Sword Coast. All who carry the Tadpole are governed by the brain and by extension the Chosen. It will take but one order to transform them into an army of Mind Flayers. This would have been your fate too, were it not for the astral prison and the mysterious visitor inside of it. With his help, you have uncovered the cult for what it really is. A plan of conquest orchestrated by the gods of death themselves. Together, you have the power to thwart the dead three. If you follow this path to its end, the elder brain will not answer to the chosen. It will answer to you. You know servitude better than anyone. You've been denied freedom for nearly two centuries, and are denied it still. You are hungry, beyond blood, beyond lust, beyond your unliving life itself. Will you liberate the true souls from their parasites and their religious delusions? Or will you use the power you gain for your own purposes? You will not have long to wait. All you need to do now is sleep. Or meditate, because I'm sleep enough. is not for you. Hear me. <sighs> Gather. The reckoning is upon us. The fuck? These guys, Yankee monks, are no Run fucking attack. joke. Help me. 
I need to understand why the fuck I should help you. I really do. Yes, of course. Someone made a mod to make Gale look older and more disheveled. Okay, but also this monk drip though. Attack. There's a couple mods where people have actively Don't touch me. made Excuse me. <laughs> Ow, sorry, couldn't mute fast enough. to the skull. Moving out. Oh, I have the magic touch. Hurry. I can't hold them back alone. <laughs> it's not over. Come to the skull. You are annoying the absolute fuck out of me, dude. I need you, now! Do you? Yes. See, the way that he irritates me is why I turn against him nine times out of it's ten. It's not over. Come to the skull. Yeah, yeah. In the skull that I'm at. Right, like, can I get over there? Let my form deceive you. 
I am the one that's been protecting you. I am the one that came to you in your dreams. Help me. Miss the fuck? So, this is the evil run. Do we help the Emperor? Do we kill him? Because we can turn on him now, but it'll make the final fight harder. Sorry, I'm not no. part mind flare. Help me. So do we attack or do we help the mind flare? Oh hi DC. That got you out of lurk. Surprised Mandy has not popped up to tell a story and to go away. <laughs> Just for me. Why, thank you, Mandy. All right, we're going to attack. clarity you realize the mind flare was telling the truth if it dies so do well you. shit i oh i remember what happens now if it dies it's game over Yeah, so do you all want to see what happens if I let the Mind Flayer die? I know what happens. Do you all want to see it or no? Because I've, I've done this choice before, just not on stream, I think. Because I'm pretty sure we turn if the Emperor dies. Okay, let me, let me save. So I'm going to save and let you see what happens when the mind flare dies and I'll reload. So I am pretty sure it's game over, man. Oh, don't do the thing where it takes 20 years for sinking a cloud save. There we go. You have failed us all. Just 
stomach drops. Your chest constricts. Your thoughts begin to splinter. You are found. Now you hear me. Now you yield! Oh, we're a baby illithid. You are now part of the grand design. So we're gonna reload and not die. I'm like, oh yeah, if you do that, you die. It's labor. Breaths resound like a death knell in your mind, tolling for the end of all hopes of survival and freedom. With startling clarity, you realize the Mind Flayer was telling the truth. If it dies, so do you. I kind of hate that there's one, only really one option. Thank you. With your help. We will both survive. Oh, shut it. I mean, he is cured from vampirism that way. The fuck? Oh, I thought a star got yeeted off the edge. That was fucking rude. How did you save against Tasha's hideous laughter when you're already stuck? There's no point using Spiritual Guardian. Bone chill, see how you like it. Oh, nice. I love the fact he's like, they won't know what hit him. Oh, that Gith Yankee's dead. Cool, cool, cool. Night to King Five. Gail, this is not a game of chess, bro.
Thanks for the darkness, Shadowheart. Now I can't hear anything. Oh my god, I can't do anything. I hate this. Because of the fucking darkness. You know what? Fine. I don't know, actually hit something, Jesus Christ. That was too much to ask for. Trying to still please Mistra, really? The fuck did he do to them? Seriously. Your reluctance to help nearly cost us everything. You saw reason just in time. Don't look at me like that. I'm a mind flayer, yes. And the one who saved you again. Of all the things to be indebted to, a bloody mind flayer. It was necessary. Rare are those that would openly consider a partnership with a Mind Flayer. Even those who are on a path of becoming one. It's like I said before. I'm just like you. No, you're not. An adventurer. I came from Baldur's Gate. Though I was never one to be constrained by circumstance. I longed for more. That longing brought me to Moonrise Towers on a search for treasure. To a colony of Mind Flayers who caught me, changed me into what I am now. For years, I served the Elder Brain. The one you know as the Absolute. I was a thrall like any other, but I was fortunate. I broke free and started a new life in my old city. But how? How? I sustained myself on criminals. Unglamorous, but there are plenty of them. Rarely missed. And they fueled me while I did my work. I had the cool. good fortune to meet Duke Stillman. We formed a partnership, and through her, I became the governing force behind the Knights of the Shield. The largest mercantile operation in Baldur's Gate. People referred to me as the Emperor. Such was my influence. Though of course they had no idea what I really was. How? My needs were sated. I was happy for a while. Until my true nature was discovered by the tyrant himself, Lord Gortash. He tore me from my home and brought me back to the brain, where I became a slave once again. A slave he continued to call me Emperor. The name 
was intended as a slight, to remind me of the heights from which I fell. But I have grown fond of it. It encapsulates well who I've become. God has sent me on a mission to retrieve the Astral Prism. I was one of many, but the first to find it. How Gortash or the other Chosen learned of its existence, I do not know. The moment I found it, I felt a change. My free will returning. I followed the feeling inside, and found the Githyan key. I realized what the prism was for. Containment. While my body was within the prison's bounds, my mind was free. I could resist the Elder Brain, the Chosen. Better yet, I could plan to overthrow them. All I needed to do was subdue the Githyanki and find allies in the outer world. You. We fought to tame Prince Orpheus, the son of Gith. Self. His power has been the source of your continued protection against the voice of the Absolute. The power to disrupt hive mind communication. It is the same power that enabled Orpheus's mother to bring about the fall of the Illithid Empire eons ago. A power she passed on to him, and that I leveraged for you. When Orpheus's mother left, a usurper took her place. Blackith declared herself queen of the Githyanki. Blackith wanted his power, but Orpheus rose against her, and so she sealed him and his honor guard within this prism. Bound by infernal chains, Orpheus could never leave. Bound by duty, his guard never would. They were close to breaking my hold on that prince, and if they had succeeded, we would be lost. I am relieved. You have embraced your potential enough that you could help me eliminate them. Alone, Orpheus will be much easier to control. Most certainly Orpheus. He is a threat to her reign. Some Githyanki still revere him, in defiance of their teachings. Blackith was safe as long as they believed him to be dead. But as you can see, he is very much alive. Okay. She kept him this way because she was reluctant to eradicate such power. Power that she might one day wish to take from him. If the Githyanki ever find out what she has done, there will be civil war. Blackith will be finished. There may come a time when that is necessary. Um, but there not is no guarantee Black that his power would survive Also, his that could, if that's a spoiler, I haven't seen Doctor Who special great. yet. The moment his protection is gone, you would become enthralled to the Elder Brain, just as I would. We may look different, but to the Elder Brain, we are already the same. Thralls in its design. Denial will change nothing. You have already benefited from that tadpole of yours. You seek to reverse an inevitable process. A process of evolution. When I first escaped from the Elder Brain, I too railed against the change. But the longer I have inhabited this form, the more it has grown on me. Even if my original body remained intact after I transformed, I would not return to it. Doing so would only impose limitations. As an Alithid, I have far surpassed who I ever was before. You too should embrace this change. I believe we'll have a better chance of defeating the Elder Brain if you embrace your latent Alithid potential. Nope. I've been studying you for a while now. I believe I can trigger the next stage of your nah, we're good. life cycle while continuing to preserve your independence. No. You have seen what I can do. Imagine yourself with the same strength 
the same intelligence, the same devastating beauty. Mm. If you let me, I can evolve mm. you. Even as you say the words, you feel a lurch of disappointment. This is what I I don't like with this though. Potential. I feel like as a player, if I say no, so that should be the end of it. To deny yourself what you want most in the world. I felt that. It's your nature. You cannot fight it. So embrace it. For me, this is where, especially as a writer, if the character has the option to say no, that should be the end of it. Oh, absolutely not. It wants Please to evolve. Me. But it cannot do so alone. It must commune with another. A tadpole. Nurtured by the psionic energy of the astral plane, cocooned here for millennia. Oh, absolutely, It has Ryan. become extraordinary. No. Also, it's fucking glowing. Why do I want to eat a glowing anything? And for an added layer, this is fucked up. I'm playing as a Starian who's had no fucking choice in his unlife for 200 years. Almost everyone in this game has been gaslit and girl boss to no end. Like, why? Why is this an option? No. Jesus, I need 21 to, to get the roll? Are you fucking kidding me? Absolutely not. Nope. Inspiration. Are you seriousing me? If I fail this, I'm doing the whole fight over. I refuse. Oh, blessings. A wave of disappointment. Stronger than any you've ever felt. And then... Stillness. You've resisted your lithid instincts. For now. You are not ready yet. Keep hold of it then. Until you are. It has enough vitality to further your evolution. And your allies. Perhaps you will be more inclined to try it when you see more of what our enemy can do. But we mustn't lose focus. We need to resume our journey. You heard the Chosen. The brain has gone to the city and the army marches to follow. We must not let them reach it. We must find the brain and bring it under our control. I did not consent to this shit. I don't like it. Let's have a peek inside. Keep your distance, darling. Don't mind if I do. Are you encumbered? Don't mind if 
I do. This does remind me, though, I need to figure out what we're doing for the Aresia game. I have an idea, but I also don't want to... I don't want to upset anyone who has a dog. So I thought about... I thought about having to rescue Scratch, and I'm like... No... Yes, I would like to leave the astral plane and actually go the fuck to sleep. Yeah, but Mandy and Pirate have dogs and I don't want to be that person. Also, depending on where they have to go to... to exactly. Well, I'm the... Oh. Let's yes, Lazel. Oh, that's right. Lazel wants to talk to me after that. Your parasite communes with Lazel's. Her heart races as she learns of the events inside the astral so prison. Orpheus. Gith's only son. He lives. It is not the Geek visitor that Vlakith would destroy and Voss would set free. It is Orpheus, the blood of the mother, the prince of the comet. Listen close. The Emperor spoke only in half truths. For you to know the tale of Orpheus, you must know the tale of Gith and of Vlakith. Long ago, when we rose up against our Geek slavers, Mother Gith made for the Hells to secure an alliance with the Archdevil Tiamat. Tiamat gifted the Githyanki our red dragons. Gith remained in the Hells, and Tiamat's envoy proclaimed Vlakith our ruler. The first Vlakith of many. It is Vlakith 157 whom my people now call Queen. Orpheus was, is, Gith's only son. He led his mother's own honor guard in a coup against Vlakith I. It was Kithrak Voss himself who slayed the prince in vicious battle. Or so the Varshis teach us. Yet the prince of the comet's been with us, subdued by that repugnant illithid. Should Orpheus go free, he would tear Vlakith's empire to pieces and build new glory from the scraps. seed and the sower every word Voss spoke he spoke true Orpheus is the living proof of the Queen's lies and the living weapon that conquered our gay slavers one word from his lips and the people would doubt two words and they would rage three words and they would bow to the true heir if the Githyank here to be free the Prince of the Comet must lead the way. Now will everyone fucking talk to me? So... There's been a mind flayer inside the artifact. Or oh, good. Prison, what was the problem, The whole Bacara? time we've had it. Sounds like utter madness. Uh, Even though I've seen it with my own eyes. I wasn't. The more I learn, the less I understand just why I was sent to retrieve that thing. But it matters little now. Lady Shah has given me a new mission. 
and nope, the prison plays no part in it. Mike is fine. In fact, it seems like the Mother Superior's concern alone, and she has strayed from the Dark Lady. She will be in for a rude awakening when I finally stand before her again. But I digress. Did you want something? Oh, that's happened to me on occasion if there's ever a, a power outage. Um... I've had that happen, or I don't know if anyone else has had this happen, but Certainly. on occasion the PS5 will be yeah, I mean unless I actually ask usually I don't want tech support I just was quiet while exposition was happening Oh, I feel you, Bakaro. I keep having issues where it's like, hey, you know that external drive that you never touch? That should be fine. It's just decided not to work today. So half my games would be gone. Oh, there's Gale. Oh, quite the rug pull, eh? A mind flayer manipulating us this whole time. Such creatures are not to be trusted as a general rule, though this one does appear to have had a significant hand in our survival up to this point. At best, an ally whose motivations remain shrouded in deceit. We should be wary of what such an alliance may cost us. Well, if that had gone wrong, you would have known immediately. Wait, what? Hold on! Why? Why are we saying give it to Gale? What? Why is this an option? Absolutely not. Game, for what? No. You wish to consult me? We will need every advantage to survive the battles that are to come. And my illithid parasite has already shown its worth. <laughs> if this superior tadpole is capable of unlocking my mind's full potential, it is a tempting proposition. I am surprised you have not drawn on its power yourself. Well... As you should. When I am stronger, we are stronger. I have a concern. Are y'all seriously talking about actually using this mind flare like it's nothing? I have a deep concern. Well, I think eating it is your only option unless you want it to go in your eye. In that case, I'm like, no, nah, I'm good. Establish themselves and take their nether stones. Subtle steps. The city is close now. Followers of Lady Shah will be watching, no doubt. Waiting for my return. Shadowheart, they are not we concerned with you. Just see so you what know. They know could help us. Oh, 
I need a merchant. Because I am carrying too much shit around. Um, excuse me. I can't find my mum. <laughs> but, um, I'm... Damn. I don't know where to go. Harsh. Not the family type, then, I take it. Wow. No, I'm not, Shadowheart. She better. It's getting really sad in here. Look, I'm a vampire. I ain't worried about these fucking people. <gasps> right? What in all the hells is going on? Felt like a quick fit to topple Ramazeth's tower. Where is the entry to this fucking? You know how to use a spear. By spear. What'd you say? Spear. Huh? Oh, yay! It is only because I personally enjoy the Dragonborn. Oh, I forgot to call the Gollum Bell. Whoops. Yes. Oh, we're gonna need that. Elven Chain. I might put him in the Elven Chain and stop. She's the most cheerful little dragonborn I've ever seen. Wait, he can wear... Oh, no, that's a Starion. Bon so why, at this point in the game, am I getting 10 AC armor offered to me? Please, game. Oh. Okay, Minthara. Don't know what inspired you, but cool. Um, well, depending on what, oh, 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 shit. I just... I just had a thought. If... If we don't have Will in the party... Fresh orders? How do we ever do we ever get the option then to go find that dragon? 
Oh, hello, Kitty. Directly. Okay, okay, okay. Want more? Want less? Want to sell? Want to buy? Aww. You know where I am. Bye! Oh my god, you're sickeningly so cheerful. You know what, actually? I'm going to go to camp. Okay, 280, 350, 340. Minthara can carry the most. You want to let those go by my own Gaining ground. This child came to our camp anyway. Excuse you? I didn't even tell you where the camp was. Oh yes, all of this armor. Just selling off. <laughs> I don't know. I, s I basically told the kid, fuck off. That's fine, I'm not going far. But I did, all I said was go wait for your Listen. mom. come back yet she might come later I don't think she's coming could we maybe stay here Right? Like... You know how to use a spear. By spear. What'd you say? Huh? Sorry. Sorry. I just get so excited doing the best job ever. Yeah. Huh? I get to talk to people all day and work for the best damn smith in all of Rivington. Gildro Angleion. He's a living legend. Do you know he's won Best Smith in Rivington seven years in a row? And, and, he says that if I move enough stock, I might even get to have a go on the anvil. I mean, 
I love what I do. Don't get me wrong. But actually doing something with my hands and all that fire... I'd give anything to do what he does. Oh, God. Don't tell him I said that, will you? I really love my job. Promise. Oh, yay! I've never actually talked to her all that much. Lifebringer really isn't worth that much. That does do 20 damage. Alright. Want more? Want less? Wanna sell? Wanna buy? You know where I am. Bye! The air is ripe with magic. We'll find a way into the city. You watch the shadows. Alright, there is so much to do in Act 3, y'all. Really? Buddy is my favorite! Let's go find that guy. Baldur's Gate is for Baldurians. I just want to see what's different since Shadowheart is uh since Shadowheart is a dark justice here all right Back off and return to your homes. That's an order. Why don't you protect us instead of the... Baldarians! Stand with me against this tide that threatens to overwhelm us. Please just go home. You're ruining a perfectly uneventful posting with this nonsense. The flaming fists are supposed to protect this good city, but they allow trash and vermin to take our homes and goods. Oh. Another visitor, I see. Listen, we keep letting the likes of you in. Soon, there'll be no room left for any of us true Baldarians. Oh! Excuse me? I was born inside the city walls, a Baldarian through and through. Wherever you're from, Clearly, they don't teach manners. I'm not paid to debate with civilians. Young ladies, shut the up excess of refugees work. outside the city walls could easily become a surplus of laborers. Careful, Minthara. As a drow exile, you could be classed as a refugee yourself. Not volunteering, I take it. I am a daughter of House Bainray. I obey no authority except my own desires. I can think of at least... What a sight for sore eyes. I believe there's somewhere you're supposed right. to be. No? Long overdue, in fact. Do I know you? No, but I know you. 
I was told to keep watch for you, and point you towards home should you ever appear. And lo, you have appeared. Mother Superior sent you. Go on then. Where do I go? So close to home, and yet you need a guiding hand. Amazing how malleable. Oh, well, I'm fragile. glad to hear that, Lauren. The Welcome in. Can be. Hey, Panda. First, you need to continue onwards into the lower city. Then, seek out a place called the House of Grief. It may not be quite what you expect, but I assure you, it's the right spot. Go there, make yourself known. You will be given the welcome you deserve. Can't you show me yourself? Oh, no. I must remain here. In truth, I'm glad to keep my distance for now. I'm There's fine. Been some tension in the ranks. Getting through some of this Seems before I uh, head over to Eric's. The outcome of your mission. Also, I really Besides, need to fix scales. I have business to attend to, wares to sell. Mm. Our great endeavor can't run on faith alone. We need funds. Have a look, if you wish. Otherwise, I think we're done. Try not to dawdle too much in the city. Mother's waiting. Oh, that's creepy. If you're looking for companionship, I hear they can cater to almost every taste wow. in Charesse's caress. Huh? I'm not on offer, unfortunately. I was trying to buy your wares, bro. Where? How did we get there? I'm real lost how we got from I'm talking to Shadowheart and you're suddenly like hey what up though oh wait what is my longbow Hellrider longbow oh that's all my money never mind never mind I got real excited for a minute and then was like, excuse me? Oh, that's more than my money. But I'm just like, excuse me? Go enjoy your drink. I'm going to probably be on maybe another half hour because I'm sure getting an Uber is going to be a challenge later. Well, the final boss, the first boss of this game is always uh, character creation. Uh, mods, there's a note for you in, in mod chat. Oh, he is out of my price range, so. I took you for one of them for a moment. The refugees, that is. You're a recent arrival for sure, still bearing dust from the road. But you have something they lack. Dignity. Voices These this wretches guy. have nowhere to call home, nothing to live off but what they carry, and nobody to help them but themselves. 
And me, of course. Oh, they're so useful. Charity is a luxury. Fickle occasional gestures from guilty hearts. I run a business. You'd be shocked by the sort of things they bring with them. Gold and jewels, they can't easily exchange. Heirlooms, rarities, sentimental items, even cremation urns. Alas, you can't eat grandmother's ashes. Nor can you easily trade a golden candelabra for a bowl of soup. That is where I come in. Liquidity. Their heirlooms for my gold. There is an enterprise within the city that I help to support. I know I said I wasn't given to charity, but this place is dear to my heart. I'd tell you more, but they value discretion above all, as do I. I was trying to see if he would talk about, if he would mention the Gur again. Can I get away with killing you? You and I have nothing more to say to one another. All right, then you discount fucking Ringo Starr. How are they gonna see it? What happens if they don't see it? See it? Really? No. No. That just won't do. Oh, Biscotti. Look, I know you're not gonna see it, so you might as well be on your way. I'm a. Oh, goodness. You said it! Aww. Wondrous day! Biscotti! I am a good dog! You can come back! I like you! You? I no, thought I'd lost I'm afraid my... I must insist you do not pet the hound. My love, you can't keep being so rude to strangers. It's just a dog. All the grabbing and touching startles poor Biscotti. I will not apologize for caring about my boy. Oh, trust me. Your eyes say it all. Everyone wants to pet him. Some of us don't. Oh! Whatever the dog thinks, being here is much better than being out there. Right, my dear? Well... The children can be a touch grabby, but yes, you're quite right, my darling. War is no place for a precious little baby like Biscotti, after all. Bro. Have you found some place we can wash our clothes here? Bro, why are you like this? He is real concerned about this dog. Let's go talk to the girl. So in my other playthrough, where I wound up romancing Gale, I killed the girl. Gonna get Grunch into the city, wounded as he is, but we have to. Who's Grunch? Ah, oh, whatever you need, I can't help you. Even talking is painful right now. Oh no. Whoo, close. 
I was After real worried. After a quick examination, you conclude that your patient is pretending to be wounded. wounded. You wonder why. Really? This isn't necessary. I'm sure there are other people that need your help more urgently. <laughs> Shh, so if those lads find out I'm faking, they might go off on their own. They're not ready for that. And frankly, I'd miss them. I don't really have any other friends. Aww. And I like those lads. So I think I'll stick around a while more. Aww. He'll miss them. Hail, friend. Fine day, isn't it? Forgive me, you're in no mood to talk about the weather. Your journey here was a hard one, no doubt. Is this your first time in Baldur's Gate? It's a fine city, isn't it? No better place to hail from. Used to be you'd arrive knowing you had a full belly and a warm bed waiting for you. Not anymore. These days, there's belly enough to go around. I had the refugees on top and well. Folk aren't feeling too generous. I've been asking myself the same question. I wouldn't be the first to interfere. Some well to do's in the city donated enough to see the newcomers right for the time being. Only they didn't bother helping everyone else. Locals going without while strangers feast. It stoked the fire, all right. Jesus. Some Baldarians are kicking up a fuss round the front of the barn as we speak. If I wasn't wearing this uniform, I'd walk round there and teach him a lesson they'd never forget. A flaming fist isn't what it used to be. It's grown weak, corruptible, soft. It's down to honest citizens like me to stand up for what's right, uniform or no. That lot round the front, they've got it coming to them. Too bloody right. They've gone soft behind those walls. Forgotten what it's like to struggle, living hand to mouth. I say we march round there and slit a few bellies. Remind them how much worse things could be. What do you say? Oh my god, these fucking choices. Why does it matter? Innocence makes the blood run clearer. Ah. Uh. <clears throat> so, you're the lick spittle who crushed the bone lord's throat. Have you come begging, sniffing for our stones? Gordash won't like that. A throat his black hand can't choke the spit from. You'll need to bleed and carve this city if you want to turn him to grave meat. He shivers at the thought. When you find the Lordling, tell him Orin is watching. No. Orin was a shapeshifter. Which means we can't trust anyone. Not even each other. Well, that was a thing that nearly happened. That's not how any of this works. 
<clears throat> Orin, and I do not exaggerate, is a murderous psychopath. Doubt she would agree to a code word. You remember that spiced apple loaf we had in Waterdeep? Oh, the big one. God. We got here first, friend. You're welcome to whatever scraps we leave behind. All right. Let's hope for gold. Take the wood from the cartoon. That'll be good for fire. If nothing else. Find us bloody keepers, I say. Bloody savages, a lot of them. We're as desperate as the rest of these savages. That's curious. Than us. Interesting. Frey, thou disc durovna. Frey, thou disc ablast. You recognize the funeral rites of the Gur people, the same monster hunters you met in the Hag Swamp. Their leader is burning the possessions of those who have fallen. Im orak, nete, krasin, netra. So, the impossible spawn walks among us in the blazing sun. We have been looking for you. Hello again, my erstwhile quarry. I did not think to see you here, of all places. The last time you came to our camp, you stole our children, <clears throat> our future. When I was hunting you, I was to bring you back here, interrogate you, discover how to save our children, and then destroy you. But things have changed. You have changed. Is it true you left your master? That you broke the spell that binds you to him? It matters because you hey, were the last hope you? to rescue our little ones from Kazador Czar. We Happy have tried to you. save our children once already, attacking the Vampire's Palace at first light. Even then, it was too done? well defended. But you, you are someone he wants, someone he thinks he can control, but with powers beyond his imagining. He will throw his doors open to you, lower his defenses, and you will save the children you damned. We offer you a chance, perhaps your final chance, to heal just some of the pain you have caused. So tell us, who are you? Someone worthy of redemption? Or the monster the world believes you to be? Nice. Then we would choose revenge. We would see Kazador Zar's legacy burned to nothing, and all vampires driven from Baldur's Gate. All but you. Do this for us, and we will leave you alone. You have lived a life of violence and sin. You have stolen lives, broken families, and caused immeasurable grief. Doing this will not right those wrongs. But it will be a start. You may still be redeemed. Please go. Time is short. 
but we will see you again when it is done. Well, you're about to be real sad, lady. Cause, uh... People. So, on my other branching run where I accidentally romanced Gale, um... I... Killed the Gur before they could show up when you go fight Gazador. But we are going to stop soon simply because it, I've been on nearly five hours. I haven't really had lunch. Uh, I'm just skipping right ahead to dinner and uh, drink for New Year's. I mean, honestly, why does anyone have to pay in Baldur's Gate? Oh, we won't have the Harper quest, I realized. And we can skip our way around dealing Oh I will. I've got um snacks I'm gonna take with me. I wonder. And uh Oh, dang it. Well, let's not go there. Wait, is this the other side of the bridge? It is. Ha ha. You don't have to talk to them if you don't want to. Also has rooms. You're not staying in a brothel. It's got private rooms. I've had so many victims for Cazador, yeah. Confuses me for a member of Star. I'd probably break this. Good day. Word to the wise. Give that ill mate to Temple a wide berth. Then buggers. Certainly not bringing my trade there again. <laughs> they wouldn't let me in. Spouted some tripe about my sort and absolutist murderers. I only wanted to sit down a minute. So did I. Let me show you. So I don't think Gail has learned that yet.
There can be no respite. <laughs> Pleasure doing business. So I believe we find a starring siblings upstairs. That is the Grim Forge armor with Vanta Black Die. So let's do this, and I'm probably gonna call it because I've been on almost five hours. I'm here. I won't let anything happen to you. You know these people. Spawn bound to Casador, just as you once were. We'll leave for the Black Mass soon. I only need one more mark. We don't need another. The Master said we have enough. It's not for the Master. It's for me. I spent 100 years eating rats and dogs. But soon, I'll be free to feast. Oh. I'll have someone there, ready for me. Once the Mass is done, and our Master oh, grants us this? our freedom, I want a drink. Cannot be. But it is. And as arrogant as. Oh, ever. Petrus. You think you can just walk back in here with some stupid quip on the eve of the Master's ascension? Brother, please. Just come home with us. There is no need to fight. Don't be an idiot, Dal. He's all talk. Always has been. Go on, brother. Show us what you can do. How? It's not possible. It's a trick. Some glamour or spell. True power only comes from the master. Oh, and Petrus. Soon. Petrus, you doofus. Believe me now. Astarian, please. I'll tell you everything. Just release him. I kind of want to just leave him there like that. Yeah, but I'm not the one burning in the sun. How could you turn on us? We're family. What? I'm gonna find you when the mass is done, brother. Then you'll see what real power looks like. Which means our next long rest. They're going to absolutely attack me. Well, shit. All right, well. Time to start off with a million fucking quests in Come to Gate, he said. 
Adventurers just get, get welcomed, welcomed as heroes, heroes he, he said. said. Poxy Drim and his bleeding notions. Confuses mm. me. Bloody ages we spent hiking from Murren. And they won't let us in the city proper. Bollocks. We're adventurous, damn it. You're damn right. I can't believe they wouldn't let us in. The bridge guard chatted some shite about a coronation. Couldn't really make head nor tail of it. I probably can. But as we've we've said before. We can bunk with ten other people and pray none of them have sticky fingers. Uh, oh, what's her face doing here? Yourself. An elf. Such temptation. I loved many in my day, but never one so fair. Grace, elegance, just wait just met to me. be shattered. Oh yes, I know your bliss. A sturdy dwarf, a leather whip, she gives, you receive. Or have I misjudged you? Ma'am. Sweeting, are you blushing? There is no shame in pleasure, even less when the pleasure is pain. It's fee on you, see. I mean, she Our is a madam. librarian. She isn't here today, alas. Your penance must wait. Well, we've other ways to fill your void. A drink for one, a pair of drow for another. Choose your sin. Nisha, our lovely nymph, but she's engaged in the nymph's grotto on the top floor, sweeting. The client's a favorite of hers, too. I doubt you'll be able to tear her away. Oh, we will. But we are blessed to have a devil in residence at the moment, a temporary guest. But he asked that I send any potential clients his way. Everyone who's paid a visit looks quite changed by the experience. Gail looks so mad. Indeed he did. Raphael. Raphael. Exceedingly handsome and with a voice that could make the foulest blasphemy seem the sweetest hymn. Sweeting. I'm no fortune teller. If I had a crystal ball, I promise I'd already have consulted it. Truth is, Fionn's gone well missing. And my hands may be skillful, but they were not made to turn every last stone she might be hiding behind. One second. Twins, yes. Hands of such skill they could turn stone to silk. Your body could suffer, no not they can't untangle. They're through the curtain to the right. You'll need coin and stamina in abundance to enjoy their services, but the gold will be as well spent as you are. To service is my calling, not to be served. Ugh. But I'd be a fool to say no. The girl kept my coffers near overflowing. Two flights up, then turn right and right again. That's Fionn's pleasure room, Elminster's library. Here, take the key. Elminster's library? People will get their thrills in the strangest of places. I'm listening. All right, I think that's it. I'm almost at the five hour mark. I'm tired and I want to make it till midnight. 
which is seven and a half hours away. So, we're gonna. Librarian. Damn, Hoots. That. I'll take that as a compliment. Take it however you want. But I'll be having my usual from now on. Oh. It's Raphael's favorite misadventurer. Good to see you again. Even if you have put me out of the pocket. pockets. The boss bet me five soul coins you'd reach the city in one piece. He rented a room upstairs in the hope that you'd drop by. Indeed we do. Seems like an age ago that the boss sent me to keep an eye on you. Take your time. Have a drink. Sample the goods. Go see him when you're feeling refreshed. And with that, we're going to save, because I know if I go to camp, um, we have to deal with a star and siblings. So, let's see who's on. Fair's on, Misty's on. Oh, Misty's been on quite a while. You're welcome. I'm here. I won't let anything happen to them. Mousey's on. Damn, everyone's on. You deserve to cut loose. The librarian does this thing with her whip on on all fours, and it? Which means we're getting a real... Anna! Anna! I can't hear you! Same with such a prude. Birthday boy's just nervous, but don't worry. You too. Happy New Year in case I don't chat with you. I'm trying to... Well, don't go anywhere. We're looking... I'm looking for someone to raid. See who's on. Mods only. Do you have a raid recommendation? Again, that is mods only. Exactly. Pleasure isn't just physical it's a state of mind probably doesn't make any sense it will when you if i don't get a recommendation i hit up alexander ward he's playing warhammer i have not had a chance to raid him uh we raided fair the last couple of times so i want to spread the love but Fair also only has four people. Alright. Things gonna be fair. Cause looking at numbers, Fair has less viewers. For me, it's going to be a raid and run. Um, Drow Twins raid. Wh what? My emotes are not working. All right, my emotes aren't working for some reason, so hopefully they go through on the raid fair. But uh, happy new year to anyone in Australia. It's already 2024 for y'all uh, in a couple hours. Yeah, on my end, my emotes are not showing, so not sure what's going on. But uh, be safe, be kind. May 2024 treat all of us better. And probably no stream tomorrow because I'll be with my partner and then doing other stuff. May not stream again until Tuesday or Wednesday morning. But don't forget, Wednesday night, there is a um, Rivals One Shot over on CD Games channel. So if nothing else, I'll see you Wednesday with the Rivals. Happy New Year, y'all. Have a good one. Bye.